been asked by loads of people on our beginners wood turning group on where I get my maker's marks from. This is a 13mm pin badge without the pin on the back. Now I got these made by a company called Awesome Merchandise, the link will be below. Based up in Leeds in the UK but they've got an American sign as well, I think it's um, Texas or somewhere in, in America so I guess they're pretty much worldwide. So this is a 30mm soft enamel pin badge. You can get soft enamel which gives you the the ridges and the texture or you get hard enamel which is a smooth surface but both are hard and both are perfectly um, suitable for putting on the bottom of the bowls. So first of all as well a shout out to Martin at Hampshire Sheen because he did a video on this last year on his YouTube channel which gave me the idea and I, um, I managed to catch up with Martin at Harrogate this year. This year? It was last year, it definitely wasn't this year um, at the Harrogate show um, just to um, have a look at his pin badge and um, get some more ideas off him. Don't we miss doing shows, Make It Central, Harrogate, North of England, wood to, woodworking shows, Midlands woodworking show. I hope 2021 is, is um, better than 2020. Um, so, there's my pin badge. Just to give you an idea, this is a, this is a bowl. It's something I'm working on at the minute. Colored in Hampshire Sheen intrinsic colours. And on the bottom, there's my maker's mark. I think it just gives it that little bit of um, extra. If you're selling, I don't know, even if you sell on XT, but especially if you're selling the shows and people are picking your bowls up and putting fingerprints all over them, always annoying. But yeah, they're picking your bowls up and um, having a look and they turn it over and see that. I think it just gives it that little bit of extra um, extra quality to um, to your piece. So all the links you need will be below. If you do take the plunge. Let me know. It was about, I think I paid 100 and, oh, I can't remember. I shouldn't really give a price unless it was right. I think it was about 170 quid. It's quite expensive, but um, if the wife's watching, it was 50 pounds. 50. Um, but it's, I think it worked out about 1 pound 50, 1 pound 60 each. And I think it adds so much to the bowl. It's, um, it's, it's, it's really worth the money. Um, just on a note, what I would do, it's going to be close to this camera. It's just make sure when you design this, all your writing is quite large. Because even when I was looking at the the proofs on my computer, it looked okay. Then I got the badges, and it is a little bit small. This bit here, it says it says a signature piece, which I thought was a brilliant tagline. You can see it, but it, it it's really really um, a bit small. So if I redesigned these, I'd, I would probably just make my signature uh, maybe a little bit bigger, and just make this bit a little bit bigger. So just be careful when you're designing it. Um, use use the biggest font. Keep it quite simple as well. I I, I originally had my website on here and um, nah, get rid of that. So we, we got the uh, we got the Union Jack and the um, Nottingham UK. That's okay. So people can see where it's from. Signature, my name on the top. Just just I will keep it just as basic as you can. Um, but yeah, let me know. Oh, let me know how you get on. Yeah. So if you. If you can, don't forget to subscribe. Um, we've got a few things we're working on at the minute. One of which is this. I'll also put a link to this video. This I did part one of this video, um, but it was a good few months ago, and I um, discovered the wood was still quite wet. So now this is a chance to dry. This is this is a video that hopefully should be up and uh, running in maybe a few weeks. Um, but yeah, we've got lots of projects coming on. So uh, coming on, coming up. So please subscribe and. Um, Hopefully, see you soon.